In this quick tip, we'll take a look at the new motion filters in ProShow 9. New in both ProShow Gold and Producer version 9, motion filters let you apply ready-to-use animations to your photos and videos. Unlike slide styles, which are applied to the entire slide, motion filters are applied to the individual layers that appear within a slide. These filters specifically determine how a layer first appears on a slide, what it does during the slide, and what happens to it at the end of the slide. To apply a motion filter, in Slide Options, select a layer from the Layers list, and click on the Filters tab. In the Motion Filters area, select a Fly-In, Normal, and Fly-Out filter for your layer. To get a better look at how the filters will affect your layers, click one of the Browse buttons to open the Motion Filters window. At the top of the window, use the Fly-In, Normal, and Fly-Out tabs to toggle between the different movement stages. To the left of the preview, you'll find all of the available filters. As you click on a filter, you'll get a real-time preview of what the filter will look like when applied to your layer. By default, the preview window will only show you the currently selected filter. However, you can change that to get a better feel for how the fly-in, normal, and fly-out effects work together by checking the Show Combined option at the bottom of the window. When enabled, the preview will show you all three stages. Notice that there's a slight pause in between each stage. If we enable the Use Normal during Fly In and Fly Out option as well, the preview will display all three filter effects in one continuous movement, just like previewing the playback of your slide. Back in Slide Options, you can enable the same smooth playback behavior by clicking the Combine option here. Additionally, you have the options to adjust the speed and duration of the motion filters. You can adjust the speed of the normal filter by typing in a value or by using the slider to choose between 0 and 200%. The duration options allow you to adjust the percentage of slide time used by the fly in and fly out filters. Setting a lower value will make the filter effect happen more rapidly. In contrast, a higher value means the filter effect will be slower as it plays for a larger percentage of the slide time. Motion filters look great on their own, but feel free to combine them with ProShow's other motion effects when you're ready to expand your creative options. Thanks for watching. Be sure to visit our blog, like us on Facebook, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for even more helpful tips.